This is recording. We'll just see what we get out of this. In the end, this is just a test run. Let's uh, let's have fun, I guess, right? Try it out, see how it feels, and also, oh, yeah, that's a big one. Yeah. All the way left to all the way right, and also how I get distracted um, by traffic while talking. Or the other way around. I want to talk, not get distracted. That's bike. Bye here. Yep. Um, see, that's what I mean. I have to focus on traffic first and foremost. And when I try to say something, I have to uh, think a little bit about my words. So. We'll see how oh, this will be a problem in the edit or not. If I can use like takes, um, or if I have to like chop it off in order to make it sound and, and uh, authentic and nice. All right, so this is not a beautiful location right now, you know. But we're just going to ride uh, somewhere. Okay, so nobody there. Let's go! What we're gonna do now is we're gonna continue the ride. We're gonna find a spot somewhere up there. I know there's, I think, somewhere on this road a possibility to go up. Because of the shitty weather, nobody will be there. Look at those folks. There are actually three people with a dog going for a walk. Okay, never mind. I was just saying there will be no people around and uh, I will be the only one, but nope. I saw exactly those two groups immediately. Look at that, eat that. It's not what I had in mind when I was like, I want to have a nice uh, moto vlog, but come on. It is unique, it is beautiful. It is something, it's something else, eh? Speaking of motovlog, I'm really curious if this whole audio setup is gonna be something because in the end it's the most important part of a motovlog. We have not found yet a nice way up to, to stop for a moment. There was this one spot where I actually saw those people so probably that, that, that might be the one, that might be the spot. So I will do this whole... Uh, shoot today with my Insta360 action cam that I have. I think we are shooting in 4K right now. Meaning, that's okay. It's gonna be fine. For whatever I, for, for my purposes, this should be totally fine. Even for the website, having an image or like a frame, a still from this video is gonna be enough. So we're gonna go up here now. Right. Yes, perfect. Perfection. Let's go home. Might be something, might be nothing.
if this setup, if this today's uh, experiment is a failure based on pure audio setup, I think that's the main uh, culprit that my footage or my whole my whole ride today won't be good. I still will use it in some way, in some shape or form. I imagine there will be some kind of um, issues with the audio right now. The other thing is, if I want to continue using the Cardo as my recording app, you know, I would love to be able to use the DJI mic that I have, but in order to do a that so right now it's on the outside I would need to run it into the helmet I mean the the benefit of having the cardo is really that it has this all integrated setup in my hand already they do some AI noise reduction kind of thing so I don't know how good it is I don't I hope chop my voice if it starts chopping my voice that will be really ah, no. It will be really annoying um, if it does do that. Well, who knew? The audio is choppy with the cardo. Um, I had it also on medium sensitivity, or like 50% sensitivity, which was the default setting. I now tested it on high sensitivity and that's a little bit better but I still do not like the app UI and the fact that it's recording to the smartphone directly so what I'm gonna do is I want to use this DJI mic for my setup and I ordered now um, a dead cat so I can actually get this little lavalier mic into my helmet and adjust this little thing here so I just pop it off just pop it off here boop, and then put the dead cat on it's not here yet so this is the one from the DJI but it will basically get on here and I'll make some close-ups of it next time once I have it so this is the idea because then I can use these two little mics one for the exhaust sound which I already am using and one for my voice and then I can record them separately on these devices locally and have them available. So I think that's the best setup for me personally because the DJI um, mic bundle, this is the, the version one that I still have. Maybe in the future um, I'll adjust it, make something different. But for now, I think this is the best solution for what I got. So that's the plan for the setup. And once it's in place, I'll show it to you and uh, you can, you will be the first to hear and see it. All right, until next week, bye.